Hi, it's Sophie. Um, it's a Friday morning. I don't have class until two o'clock and I thought this would be a great time to uh, try to make an English breakfast, which is something that I've had a couple times and I'm gonna do my best to try to make it as authentically as I can. Um, we'll see if that works or not. Um, yeah, cool. All right, come along with me. I started off by going to Sainsbury's to get some groceries with my friend Emma, who's right here. So I've had the um, full English breakfast a couple of times. Um, I went to an Airbnb, um, they served it there, and I went to a cafe. I've never actually like seen it made, so this might not be the full authentic version, but I'm gonna try my best and hopefully it'll taste the same. Um, so the British breakfast consists of a couple of things. We've got eggs, we've got our basic British barn eggs. Woo! Um, they're usually fried. Um, uh, or scrambled. I'm gonna do mine fried because that's how I like it. Something cool about British eggs is that they don't refrigerate them. Um, in the store they're just kind of like all sitting out, which is, you know, Americans usually refrigerate their eggs, so it's kind of cool. Also, um, fried mushrooms, um, fried tomatoes, as you can see um, a lot of this is fried. Um, fried sausages, there's also usually um, uh, black pudding, which is like congealed blood and some other stuff, and also bacon. And British bacon is a lot different than American bacon. It's like thicker. Um, I'm not really a huge meat person, so I decided to forgo the black pudding and the bacon, but I'm gonna get some sausages, which is cool. Um, also, hash browns by Sainsbury's. Um, you can see this is like the full English breakfast, and that's exactly what I'm going for, the Sainsbury's hash brown package ideal. Also, some toast. And, of course, the classic, Heinz beans. Zzzz. Um, the British are really big on their beans. Um, there's a whole bean aisle in the grocery store. Um, these are the personal sized version, but they also have varying varieties. The British really do eat a lot of beans on toast, which I thought was just a joke. I didn't realize that was real. But yeah, they serve it all the time. So I'm gonna do that. The first thing I did was put the hash buns in the oven before I started cooking everything else. Cool. So I'm going to start with frying the sausages. Um, it's mainly frying this cooking, I've realized. Also going to fry some mushrooms. Yeah. So the hash browns are out of the oven, and the next step is... Ah! <laughs> I didn't see that, but I just knocked over a pan and tried to grab it with my bare hand. It's fine, I'm, I'm okay, but... Woo! Kitchen safety, folks! Um, I, what I was trying to grab for is this tomato. I'm gonna cut them and uh, grill them, um, which I think is my favorite part of the British breakfast. I really like the kind of um, uh, greeniness of the tomato. Um, also, it's nice death of vegetable, because um, a lot of it's just kind of fried food, which is good, but it's nice to pretend that you're healthy too. At this point, Emma started filming for me, which was really nice of her. <laughs> you could do like the magic chef thing. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh. <laughs> I can't get all of it. <laughs> <laughs> I can, that can be mine. It looks really nice. It can be less burnt the next time. Cool, there it is. <laughs> There's the full English breakfast um, with guest stars Emma and Zach. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope that this was fun and enjoyable for you. Cool. Until next time. Oh, and there it is in its full glory. So here's the 
give it to my pot. Oh no, my pot's been foiled! Um, this pun is courtesy of Zach, who is um, being useful, and I'm just standing here making puns, which is, is par for the course. <laughs>